tonight, guns in parks. It recently became a hot issue in Oconomowoc after this picture resurfaced showing a boy on a slide and a man with a gun nearby. That's right. 12 News' Max Siegel reports tonight another community is revisiting its ban. Stephanie Huxdorf took her girls to Nixon Park in Heartland Tuesday. It's a nice big area to run around, so it's enjoyable. But this mom isn't enjoying the news about a proposed change to allow licensed gun holders to carry here. I'm not so sure about that. I feel like it's probably safer in the suburbs to not have open arms. Village President David Lamoran says Heartland's following a similar move from Oconomowoc last month. The issue came to light there after this picture on Facebook showing a man with a gun near a boy on a slide. Conomowoc did some homework and discovered state law allows open carry in public parks. Heartland found out the same. As far as the state goes, it's okay, it's permissible, so we decided we've got to be in compliance. Why have an ordinance on the books that we cannot enforce? Heartland and Oconomowoc are just some of the latest communities in southeastern Wisconsin taking a look at their policies for guns and parks. We also checked around other parts of the region to see where they stand. Cities like Brookfield, West Allis, Whitefish Bay, and Glendale all follow the state rule for open carry in parks. Some parents, there? like Nick Golke, are cool okay. with it. If you look at all the incidents that have happened, it's all places where guns are banned. In Heartland, Max Siegel, WISN 12 News. Heartland's Village Board plans to vote on amending its ordinance for open carry in parks in about two weeks.